Ah, Master Georgia. Uh, have you uh, made any plans for your next painting? If you don't paint, you can't earn. <laughs> you don't want to end up broke, do you? What about painting... Uh, what was it called? Um, uh, uh, Winter's Serenade in Bloom? Oh, so what? Your clients' preferences are what matter most. Uh, don't worry, Master Zhuzhen. I handpicked your clients and know them like the back of my hand. That painting was outstandingly popular. I would know. Trust me, this will be another bestseller. Of course. Take your time, Master Zhuzhen. Let me know when you've decided. walk now. Maybe I'll find some new inspiration. This place... It's all so beautiful. I have to capture it. Let me find the perfect spot to stop and pee. The landscape looks great from this side. It's perfect for planning my painting. Waters and mountains rest by the pain. Valleys and peaks in the dream remain. The composition looks fine, but something's still missing. Maybe I should get closer to see the tiny details of the trees and rocks. should be close enough. Water lamp? Do vetch! Pearl leaf and bitberry. These vibrant plants harmonize exquisitely with the cold stones. Tacit discords like that here. Hmm. They do complete the scene I had in mind. show this draft to my manager. Master Judge. Okay, uh, Master Judge. <laughs> uh, about the painting I mentioned last time? Ah, very well, let's see. Uh, what? <laughs> What's this? Uh, you're a true master. Would a master present a client with a half-finished piece? Hmm? Your last painting sold for the highest price at auction. Give the people what they want, that's what I always say. You just need to paint it again, and I'll make sure it sells well. With all due respect, Master Zhuzhen, not everyone will buy whatever you paint. Now, I've worked so hard to find a few clients who love your style. 
How can I sell your paintings if you can't cater to their needs? Please, just focus on recre- <laughs> I mean, creating tonight. I won't disturb you. I'll come and pick it up tomorrow. No more indulging your every creative whim. All I'm asking for is another winter serenade in bloom. I'm counting on you, Master Zhezhe. I have to make another copy. call myself an artist then in their eyes am i only capable of copying my old work judge First winter serenade in bloom. Yes. I saw flowers blooming in the middle of winter, and birds were circling around. You worked really hard on that. And that hard work should be noticed. and peaks in the dream remain. Colors of vanity washed away. The painted world fades, forgotten today. Witness the art's true form! from Winter Serenade and Bloom. I keep telling you, your clients only want that one painting. Don't be so stubborn, Judge. A painting that doesn't sell well is meaningless. I'm the artist, not just the brush. It's the soul I put into my paintings that makes people appreciate them.
Watch out! Nice job. Perfect. Dreams cleansed. Power restored. I can talk now. Sonoa is growing faster. If this keeps up, Solaris will be in danger. Walk through more gateways. Save people from dreams. Fight the person. I'm counting on you. Talking drains my energy. Need to rest now. From the looks of it, I'm probably the only one who can enter the Song Noir as I please. Besides that cat, the only other people here are the ones trapped in their dreams. I will be the one to help them escape. A long, long time ago, there was a brave warrior in the magical kingdom. Her name was Encore. One day, she met her good friend Cloudy. Come on, Cloudy. Cloudy said she was a princess from a wonderful play. Everyone loved her performance. Out of nowhere, a big bad demon appeared. The big bad demon sent its minions to attack the magical kingdom. Everyone hid at home, and the stage was empty and quiet. But then, Warrior Encore stood up and said she would fight the big bad demon. To bring the crowd back, Cloudy, the great performer, also joined Encore's team. Ah! Oh. Attack, you're in! Woman, let her... Leave? Me? Oh, no! Here comes Encore! 
leave? Me? Oh. But not everyone in the Magical Kingdom was very nice. One day, Warrior Encore met Cosmos. Cosmos. I used to live in the magical kingdom, but I went on a big adventure far away. When I came back, no one knew me, and they wouldn't play with me. Huh, if you're not Cosmos's friend, I'll just go join the big bad demon and cause trouble. Really? That's so nice of you. <laughs> Sad little adventurer Cosmos was so moved by these words. This special friendship made him join Encore's team. With his brave heart, Cosmos decided to fight the big bad demon and save the magical kingdom with Encore. Bah! friends marched to find the big bad demon. The sly demon sent its monster squad to try to stop them. But they were not afraid. Ha! Princess Cloudy and adventurer Cosmos used all their skills to support warrior Encore. In the end, Encore's super team took care of the monsters. But the Woolies got hurt. Leave me alone! No one picks on Uncle's friends! Ha! To help them feel better, Warrior Encore climbed all the hills and swimmed all the rivers. She walked a long way and finally found the magic golden sprout. She picked it up carefully and ta-da! She made medicine that healed the woolies. Then the super team marched on their way to fight the big bad demon. Bad demons sent more monsters to stop Encore, but every one of them was defeated by her super team. Their amazing feats made lots of people in the Magical Kingdom excited. More and more people wanted to join Encore's team. After careful picking by Warrior Encore, they chose the Candlestick Fairy, who breathes fire. Encore also picked Grey Ear the Rabbit, who can slice bread into 100 pieces, and the Stool Spirit, who likes to zoom around on four legs. Then came Miss Clover, Uncle Broom, and Grandpa Cole. With more friends joining, 
Encore's team got bigger and stronger, becoming their super duper awesome team. to fight the big bad demon. Gray Ear the Rabbit made yummy bread for everyone so they wouldn't fight on empty stomachs. Cloudy put on a show about a brave princess the night before to cheer everyone up. On the big battle day, Adventurer Cosmox led the super duper awesome team to dodge traps and face the big bad demon. They battled it out. McWolver blew wind. Grandpa Cole and the Candlestick Fairy made fire. Grayer the Rabbit held Uncle Broom and rolled the stool spirit to charge at the big bad demon. Everyone fought bravely. Encore's team stopped his evil plan and brought peace back to the magical kingdom. Hmm. Oh. You beat me today. There'll always be more demons in this kingdom. Someone's gotta be the big bad demon. But why did you have to pick this path? Before I was big and bad, nobody paid any attention to me. Now they all fear me. But you could be a hero like me. Me? <laughs> no, no, I can't. I don't have your bravery. More importantly, I don't have any friends. It's okay. Being a hero isn't just about fighting or going on adventures. Uncle Broom keeps the castle spotless. Candlestick Fairy keeps things bright. They don't need to be on my team to be heroic warriors. They already are. Just do your best at everything and have fun. That's how heroes do lots of cool stuff. Don't worry, you can do it too. Okay, the magical kingdom is now called the Warrior's Kingdom. Yes, with a happy ever after ending. Hooray! I'll tell a new story next time.
didn't I just leave the Sommoir? Why am I still here? Encore's not here. Did she leave already? Let me see if I can find another gateway. The gatekeeper. Who's the one beside him? Excuse me, sir. Is this all real? Are you the god of this realm? How did you get in? I don't know. I was supposed to be at my grandma's funeral. I was watching over her and lost track of time. The next moment, I was here. Maybe I fell asleep? A part of your consciousness entered Somme Noir when you fell asleep. Somme Noir? What's that? Some kind of scenario? No. But you can think of it that way. Well, just now, I met a girl around my age. She had the same name as Grandma. She lived in the same town, had a group of friends, and liked to catch dragonflies in the mountains. The only difference is, the temple that should be demolished by monsters was still there, east of the town. Grandma used to say that people would pay tribute to their ancestors in that temple every year. The ceremony would be as grand as the moon chasing festival. As much as she loved that town, she never stopped wanting to explore the world outside it. Um, I heard the Sonoro Sphere can keep memories of people or even a place's history. Is that true? What I saw just now, is it real? Is that girl my grandma? My apologies, but I cannot answer that. Can I come here again? No. What happens when I wake up? Will this place and my memory of it disappear? Everything you saw here will be erased, except your memory. That I have no control over. That's a relief. Thank you, kind sir. That's given me some hope. In my memories, Grandma always took care of everyone in the family. She raised her children and they left home, then her grandchildren, repeating this cycle her entire life in that old house. I always wanted to travel, but I couldn't bear to leave Grandma alone. This dream showed me a different side of her. She was once a young girl with dreams just like me. She dreamed of traveling, meeting new people, and starting a family. Now I feel grateful to be part of such a family, and even more grateful to have this side of Grandma live on in my memories. I used to think she was old and lonely, but she really glowed with her hopes and dreams. Thank you, sir. Thank you for showing me this. That happened in the past. I was looking at their illusions. The gatekeeper showed this to me. What is he trying to tell me? Please leave the Sun Noir. Data from the last phase will be deleted. Repeat. Data from the last phase will be deleted. It's about to collapse. Better leave now. It has been some time, hasn't it? I already told you the first time we met. Somme Noir is unstable. It isn't. It's due to Somme Noir's innate design. Tell me. What do you think Somme Noir was created for? It appears so. 
that the answer is something more fundamental. Such a large and complex creation is necessary to save a world torn apart by the lament. The dreams it stores contain countless possibilities. Millions upon millions of dreams converge in Somnoir. Perhaps within one lies the key to vanquishing the lament. It may not be the most efficient or practical strategy, but even as a mere spark of hope, I believe it's worth pursuing with all the power I have. They are closely connected to you, but that's not important right now. One day, you'll find out who they are, compared to you who is of immense significance to them. I am just a tool they created to get rid of useless data. Every day, people dream that Somnoir's capacity is finite. Dreams that don't aid in defeating the Lament are deemed worthless. My duty is to erase them, like a heartless executioner. By this reasoning, the two dreams you just witnessed should also be erased. They offer no solution to save our world. What do you think? Are they useless? Indeed, those dreams are truly precious. They deserve to be remembered. Somnoir has tens of millions of gateways that lead to numerous realms. But it's still too small compared to Solaris. I need more space to store these precious dreams and memories. Those gateways that appeared by the Whining Axe's mire. It's all because of you. Yes. Those places will become part of Somnoir. To merge with the other dreams. Just think of it. They will be forever saved and remembered. Not every dream holds the key to saving the world. Most are personal. Trivial. Even selfish. But still, they should not be erased. People may eventually forget them, but Somnoir won't. You saw that girl, and how deeply she felt about her dream. It holds significance. you ever erased another's dreams? Their memories? Please leave the Sun Noir. Data from the last phase will be deleted. Repeat. Data from the last phase will be deleted. For millennia. I've been doing this tirelessly. Those dreams and I are no different in nature. Yet I've done nothing but extinguish them. I don't expect you to understand me. We're not in the same position. Just know that even the Great Rover cannot stop me now. This realm is about to collapse. I need to wrap this up quickly and get out of here.
person. He's awake. Black Cat. He's formidable. My power limited again. Stop him, Dreamwalker. So tired. Must rest. The cat's weaker than last time. What's worse, the gatekeeper said the expansion is accelerating. I have to stop it before it's too late. Yin-Lin, do you copy? Got an emergency for you to handle. We need you to infiltrate the Blue Camel and get their latest transaction records. Remember, don't get caught, or they'll destroy the evidence. Infiltration? Hmm. I'll need to suit up right. Gotta sever communications at their camp first. Can't have them calling for backup. <sighs> This outfit should do the trick. <laughs> That's their hideout. Time to find a discreet spot to change.
This is it. Need to send it back ASAP. Better hang on to this outfit in case I run into the guards. Hey, what's that you're holding? Open it. We need to check what's inside. We've had reports about exiles conducting illegal business recently. Red Eagle needs this. I can't let them search the box. I confess, sir. This is proof of their crimes. I can't stand their dirty deeds anymore. So I'm taking this to the Public Security Bureau myself. If you don't trust me, you can come along. Well, it's good that you want to bring them to justice. Alright, I'll escort her to the Bureau. The rest of you, resume your duties. What happened? Huh? Why are they all lying on the ground? No injuries. Looks like they just passed out. They'll wake at any moment. I need to get the evidence back to him. This place... Something feels wrong. I need to be on my guard. I've told you before not to come barging in here. Something unexpected happened during the mission. This'll be safer with you. What's this? You attacked the patrollers? For this? You've been fooled. I never gave you such an order. Can't you spot a fake transmission? You've disappointed me. Was the intel false? Or did someone impersonate him when they contacted me? Blaming me won't make any difference. I need to get to the bottom of this. Give me some time. I'll figure it out. I've been waiting for you, Yin Lin. You? Why are you here? You were once part of the Seon Society. Until you betrayed me. Now, answer me. Who are you? That's right, Yin Lin. That's who you are. And you don't belong anywhere. No one will ever accept you or see your worth. You're nothing. I'm... nobody. Yin Lin, do you copy? Got an emergency for you to handle. We need you to infiltrate the Blue Camel and get their latest transaction records. Remember, don't get caught, or they'll destroy the evidence. What is this? Time's rewound to the start of the mission. That's... me. No. I have to stop this. How can any of this be possible?
surrender your stuff. <laughs> no mercy. Yeah. Yinlen, calm down. No, everything's fine. He's the mole in the Public Security Bureau. You did nothing wrong. No, you knew it all along. Just not in this place. The mission was a success. You caught the mole and put an end to the Blue Camel's dealings. As for the patrollers, you never attacked them. No, you've always been cautious. You're just too afraid of making mistakes. That's why you dream these things. You've only ever had yourself to rely on. Yeah. But still, you never waver. Think about that question again. Who are you really? talk again power grows strong enough to fight him next time I will talk even better help me too much sleep this is the last time
Interesting. It reminds me of the Hongjin in my memories. In that year, a peculiar incident occurred. A parent lost their only child, and despite extensive searches around Mount Firmament, no trace of the missing boy was discovered. Help us find our son. We were having lunch together just two days ago. Later I went up the mountain to fetch some spring water. When I got back he was gone. She said Jing was out playing with his friends, but he never came home. I've been worried sick ever since, unable to eat or sleep. Jing, where are you now? Jing! My poor boy! Please come back home! Yes. Jing had been increasingly withdrawn, preferring to stay home. He stopped playing with his friends. But that day, he said he wanted to play with them. It seemed odd, so I asked those kids later, but... None of them had seen Jing. Oh, how can I go on without my Jing? Guests of the Unkind, heaven and sin. boy's clothes since his infancy are neatly folded, except for his pajamas. Hmm. The board is set, but the final move is yet to be made. Guests of the Unkind. Yeah. Mind's Eye. Seven. Mind's Eye. Yeah. 
Beckon the divine flame. My blade yearns. My blade. Yeah. Did you find Jing? Where is he? Please tell me! What? No! My child! Who did this? Why would someone do this? What are you talking about? I don't understand. How did you find out? <laughs> Saves me the search. <laughs> ah! Mind eye. Strike. My blade yearns. <laughs> Guests of the unkind. Ah, oh, a defensive move. Not bad. Derek. But the game is already finished. My blade burns. My blade burns. You don't seem surprised to see me. How did you know they killed Jean? No child would go out in thin pajamas in such freezing conditions. So you realized it was orchestrated by the Fraxidus. You know this is a dream, right? Then why didn't you try to escape? To win a game, you must first play it. Besides, Someone who knows they're dreaming is more dangerous, don't you think? Making yourself part of the game. That's something you do. I need you right now, Chung Li. Slumber fades. Perish in flames. Feathers in sentence. Mind eye be reduced to sins. The divine flame. Cross Seven. Clears the blaze.
I was just dreaming. In that dream, I tried my best to paint something new, but no one seemed to like it. Instead, they just wanted more copies of my old stuff, treating me like some money machine. But you told me to trust myself. Thank you for supporting me. You don't have to call me master. Hi! Are you ready for Encore's new story? <coughs> it goes like this. A long, long time ago, there was a cloud kingdom where the amazing warrior Encore lived. Then she met you, Traveler Cosmos, Prince Cloudy, and many more new friends. Together, they defeated the Dark Cloud Demon. Oh, it's good, right? Stories about adventuring with friends are my favorite. I'll tell you a new story next time. Don't you worry about that! I do want others to trust me, but... My priority is making sure justice is served. When I found myself in doubt, you helped me find myself again. Thank you. I like knowing someone has faith in me. So, are you interested in the details of that case? Back then, the Fraxidus killed Jing and his parents under the cover of night. They then posed as Jing's parents and lay in wait until Xing Yi figured it out. But instead of exposing them right away, she played along, biding her time. After two weeks, the Fraxidus couldn't restrain themselves any longer. They used the pretense of searching for their lost boy to scout out Mount Firmament. Of course, Xing Yi was prepared for this. She used the opportunity to expose them in the act and capture them. I'd say your strategy is no less impressive than hers. Though our enemy's identity remains unclear, I'll support you, come what may. <laughs> I can finally talk in full sentences! Yeah, try to meow or speak three words yourself. You don't want to know how it feels. Anyway, we're down to our last gateway. Once you rescue the last person from their dream, I can finally balance my control over some noir with the gatekeepers. That's when we can launch our final attack. Meow. Hey! Don't treat me like a cat. Is this real or just another dream? <laughs> if it's a dream, it better be juicy. Huh, 
he's here too. Wait for me to catch you. The lovely smell of all my prey. Play hide and seek. The tastiest meal is always the one you've worked hardest to catch. Play with me. Let's not waste our precious time. Ugh, what a bother! Why does the Black Shores keep dumping these dull missions on me? This doesn't satisfy me at all! my standards some have potential but they're still too dull only you can really get my heart racing Is that... Camellia? She needs help. I need to go to her quick. Endure and defy. 
Faster. Right. That thing couldn't be you. You always exceed my expectations. I know. After all, you're the one I've chosen, my beloved sea. While I crave your sweet words, a part of me craves the thrill of hunting you down. Is that an invitation? You do know how to please me. I really have the chance to kill you. Taking your life won't be easy. Not with all the strong foes you've defeated. Unless, of course, you step willingly onto my blade. Anyway, it doesn't matter. I'd never force you into anything. No fun in that. Your potential, your desires, your ambitions. They're what truly excite me. But you know what's the icing on the cake? It's how you look into my eyes when you talk about these things. Perhaps one day I'll whisk you away to a hidden land, where you'll be mine and mine alone. We're here. I and all those you helped in the Somme Noir are prepared for the final battle. Once you're set, 
We'll be ready to face the one responsible for all this. Let's repair the Somme Noir and shut down his mischief for good. All set? It's time to fight! Here we come, big bad demon! I'll give this show a grand finale. If I can help, then I'll... I'll do my best! It's time to end this charade. Oh, to dance alongside you in battle. I can't wait any longer. Now, give me your battle cry. We promise, we deliver. Not that one. It should be, let's go save the world again. Somnoir has tens of millions of gateways that lead to numerous realms. But it's still too small compared to Solaris. I need more space to store these precious dreams and memories. Just know that even the Great Rover cannot stop me now! Leave it to me. You will never understand the meaning of dreams! Whisper. You're in for it now. I'm having it. Get lost. Nightmare. Break asunder. Endure and fire is power. I can feel everyone's support.
nowhere to hide. Endure and defy. Shadow descent. Shall whisper. Don't run. Keep the dance going. Sweet. Get him ready. Together, Together we will usher, usher in, in the dawn. dawn.
Let's take it slow. Mm. 